Good morning. Welcome to Powerful Life, Body, and Soul. We're here for season one, number two now. So we're doing 30, 50. So we're doing 30 seconds of cardio, 50 seconds of work, of an exercise. You're just going to need a mat, and that is it. Our cardio is going to be side-to-side -side hops, okay? So that's what we're going to be doing for 30 seconds. And then our first exercise is going to be this fun one, uh, where you're going to lay like this. Okay, and then you're gonna rotate your leg up and down, and then back, and then up and down, and then back. So you gotta hold yourself like this. You're gonna, be, you're gonna hurt on your sides, just let you know. It's gonna hurt later. But no pain, no gain, we got this. All right, so modify with Miss Erin. Um, I'll definitely be showing her things that if she needs to modify, um, that you could do. So. If you need to modify, watch Miss Aaron. All right? Are you starting with cardio? Starting with cardio, yes. Side to side hops. All right. Let's do this. All right. Ding! Okay. Let's go. I feel like we're both in all black. No, all right. <laughs> we're like, black day. It's nice and rainy here today, so we're, we're, it's gloomy town, which we're not used to. We like the sun here. We normally have sun. This is a rainy season for us. We never, we don't have. We're out of a drought now, so that's good. <laughs> We've been in a drought for what, 20 years? I've never, to my recollection, I don't remember it ever raining as much as it's raining. No, right. Okay, so you're in this position. You're gonna bring up, like fire hydrant, down, up, down, up, Back, up, down, up, back. Good job. If you do need to come down like this and do it like this, then I want you to do that. But if you can try and hold yourself up, do it. You can also use this hand to kind of hold you up. <laughs> Holy moly. <sighs> You got it. Oh, man. Holy oh, side. God. Right. Woo. That side. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Hall of Fame. Cool. Yeah, but it's so hard. 
and it's so many years ago. But I'm glad that he can still possibly be inducted. But sometimes they say after so many years, they can't, you know? Woo! All right. Oh my gosh, it's gonna hurt. It's head to head. Oh, let me get off the <laughs> So we're only doing three rounds of everything, just so you know. Oh, that's good. I feel like, thank goodness. <laughs> Pants fall now. Hop, hop, hippity, hoppity. Oh, I saw a bobcat today, too. Where? You know, I was running. Yeah, he's so cool. Um, bear crawl. You're gonna be like this, and you're gonna put your arm out, and then you're gonna tuck it around. Switch. So arm out, tuck it around. Switch. There you go. Up and around. Up and around. Good job. Hmm. <sighs> Breathe. I feel it <coughs> in my legs. <sighs> the back of my legs. And your wrists. <sighs> oh, good job. Keep going. <sighs> Two. One. Hoppers. All right, one round done. <coughs> so now we're going to do two more rounds. And then we're done. And you're going to cover yourself all long. You got it. Easy peasy. You didn't wash the flashlight yet, did you? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's pretty good. Yeah. Got to watch tonight, though, to see, like, what happens. Yeah. Oh, you can tell me. They left it on the cliffhanger. Yeah. Well, he breaks up with Anna G and Tasha. He does? Yeah, because he does. Rotation. He told me. Right, said Cassie he wants her, so. Right. Like, like his character that like he's not like having a plan b you know like for their sake right because that would be like um how is that marriage gonna work exactly and so he, I, like he's got good integrity right and, and he even knows like he feels really bad because hannah g really likes him right like, and he likes her too but he just knew that like he confessed his love with cassie basically right and so his breakup with hannah g was super sad for both of them really oh <clears throat> yeah. So I does he at all see Cassie? Cassie? It doesn't really show her last night. Oh. It shows him going to the door and talk to her at the very end. Oh. So next one will be tonight. It, they'll be pick up that, and then I guess we'll go after show them. I want you there together, but I think she should fix this hard. Do you think so? I think so. Yeah. She wants you together now, but I don't know. Oh, I mean, I hope she doesn't. But I just was so upset. That her dad was like, you know when you know. And I think that's bull. Because uh, you don't just like. Not everybody. Knows not everybody. everybody. No, and he said he knew when he was like, and, and I'm just like. Oh, yeah, my wife. No, because they didn't talk to her. Yeah, because. I don't know that. She knew that soon. Maybe he knew that soon, kind of like Colton, you know. Right. I mean, I will say with me and my relationship, he knew before I did. Yeah. And I was like, okay, like. I feel like I more grew to love him, which was better for me, right. because I feel like if I wouldn't have, it wouldn't have worked out. Right. And I feel like I still grow to love him more every day. Absolutely. And so I'm like, I don't know, I just feel like that he kind of gave false information. Right. And I, I feel like, like- That's just what they televised. Was that really a normal conversation? Right. You know what I mean? Like, well, right, because to me it's like, I don't know, I just feel like, She's trying to take what he says as truth, and that if she doesn't yeah. feel it now, then right. it's not right. Yeah. No, and that makes sense. What she's saying that. Yes, that's why I feel like she was like just you know she was taking you know um, advice from her dad, who she loves like so much yeah. and respects, you know. Right. So Basically, Colton says he's following his heart on this one, and oh, he's got that's what he wants to do. And he needs to exhaust all of his like all of his heart in chasing her, basically. Aww. Yeah. That's so cute. <laughs> I know. You know? Yeah, for sure. Like, I think that's a great like. Oh, he totally loves her so much. 
And I think she could grow to love him. I, I think mean, so. how do you know he loves somebody in Plus, she's turning great. Right. Yeah, in three months. I mean, I think she likes him, but she's probably going, is this real? It's only been three months. Like, she's probably just questioning. And he's dating other people. Right. So you don't you know? want to be too vulnerable. Right. I wouldn't. That would be hard for me. I don't think I could do that and be like, oh, yeah, I'm ready for marriage. Right. No way. And that's where it's so sad for Hannah G because he led her to believe he loved her too, which I think he did. But I just think he didn't realize until he went out with Kathy, like, how much he right. loved her. Yeah. More. <laughs> right. Oh my god, I felt so bad because he was so ready to like be with her in like the fantasy suite. I know. And he was so happy and then she was like not at all. But good for her for not. Right. Like just love not to be. Right. <laughs> yeah, I just wish she would more like do her own thing instead of listen to like even though I think her dad's nice and everything. Right. But I just don't think that a twenty three year old enough to have an opinion. Right. <laughs> yeah. But are you reaching? It's like they all live together, so Oh really? <laughs> I, I don't know, maybe they don't. Oh no, maybe she said she lived with her sister. Oh, she's still a family. Yeah. You know? She's not completely on her own. Right, I'm not trying to live in your life. Probably. Uh oh. That's good. I don't even know if I want to marry into that family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> driven. Right. Whew, I'm sweating, guys. Yeah. We'll see. All this faster talk is helping it go by faster. Yeah. This is the last bit of round two, right? Yes. We're already done with round two almost. Yes. Breathe. Good job. Okay. Side to side. Woo! Last round. Woohoo! <coughs> there. What are you and the kids doing tomorrow? Stay. I'm meeting with Cassie and Megan in the morning because it's Wednesday. Yeah. Um, okay, this is volleyball. I think that's kind of it. Well, we're not doing anything, so. Jonathan's off on Wednesdays. Oh, okay. So. Family day. Family day. Yeah. yeah. Probably just stay home, but. Yeah. Um, it's the other side. It's the other you side, right? Side, but I'm like, you can do that. Right, it is the other side. <laughs> I started on this side, I should finish on this side. Okay, so up, down, right. Yeah, because we're not doing anything. I wish that new jungle, it's not jungle, but that new place with a rock like wall. Summer, the fall is opening, right? Or when is it open? I don't even know. We asked a guy, we went there, and some worker was there, and we we're like, When's it going to open? He's like, in a month or so. Oh, okay. But then, I don't know. I mean, it seems like construction's got behind. Spring break would have been a really good time to open that up. Right? Uh, I know. The and rain then, is probably screwing everybody up. Right. It's here. You know? Yeah. Like, like, construction and stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Whew. Whew. I hate getting up after that one. I know. I'm kind of dizzy. Yeah. Well, I feel like it's because you're doing so much to hold yourself up, yeah. and then you're taking out yeah, certain time. Yeah, really quick, so like 30 seconds to jump <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I like that light behind. It looks so much better. It does. I think I'll have to keep that like that. All right. Okay. Up, down. We're in a box. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Get it. Mm. I don't know a massage on Thursday. Oh, that's that sounds nice. This week. I am so overdue. I think it's before Christmas. I don't know last time. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Justin actually went for this massage with a friend of ours that's into like tissue, like tissue repairing. Oh. He, he actually can feel the body and able to like feel where. You're hurt, so you may be hurt here, but it really is coming from here. Yeah. And he'll kind of just put a little bit of pressure and like feel and like it heals it. It's crazy. Yeah. And he works a lot with concussions. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I know I always do that. The other one feels me up. I know it feels like we need to go down on the ground, right? Um, so, yeah, my friend's son got a concussion, so we're like, go to him because he's. Really good. Like she, he got such a bad concussion that his brain shifted. Oh my gosh! In his head. That's scary. Yeah. And so, so we're trying to see.
see if maybe he can go to him and get some help. That's crazy. I know, right? It was he fell off a treadmill. Yeah. How old is he? Poor thing. He's the same age as Haley's. Or Haley's. Jeez. Yeah. Is he going to school with him? Uh, no, he goes to Australia. Poor guy, but I mean, he played soccer with us. And he just. He needs help. Well, I mean, he's a physical kid. He loves sports. And so now he's kind of like where he can't play. Right. You know? And that's so hard when you have a physical kid. Right. That now can't play, you know. No kidding. <sighs> <sighs> okay. Woo. All right. Last one, guys. Oof. <laughs> Oof. Up. <laughs> Tie body up. Yeah, because when Justin went, he was expecting like hard, deep pressure. Right. And he was like, no, I go, but I feel great. It's so weird. It's It's like, I know. Do you like Reiki? Huh? Do you like Reiki? Like, Maybe. I mean, I know that's like, you don't usually touch it, you're just like, energy stuff. Right. Okay, bear call. Last one, guys. You guys got this. You're doing awesome. <laughs> okay, arm out. Arm out. Look under. <laughs> Out, tuck under. Out, tuck under. I'm sweating. Good job. You guys are rocking it. Super proud of you. Good job. Breathe. Good job. Got it. Almost done, seven seconds. You're almost there. Breathe. Woo! You did it! Good job. High fives, high fives, high tens. Good job. Super proud of you, you guys did awesome. And you will be back here for next time, which will be our still, we're still on season one, number three. So come back for that. Remember, this is a lifestyle. It's not just a one and done. You need to keep up with it and do it as much as you can. At least once a week. I would say two to three times a week if possible. So just keep it up and you will be powerful in your body and your mind and your soul. So keep up on it, guys. You guys are awesome. Have a great, powerful day. See you later. Bye.